Hello, Christina Garcia here, also known as Teacher Tina, and I am back and I'm going to start producing more videos for you. I've kind of lost my light a little bit lately, but I am back and I am here to tell my story. So this is my truth. This video is not going to be like most of my videos, so if you are brand new to my channel, I encourage you to go and watch some other videos that are more step-by-step -step practical tips to help you get teaching. Uh, but this video really, I'm planning to share my heart with you because I just have this nagging feeling that somebody needs to hear my story. Um, and I spend all my time talking about other people's stories, but people often don't know why I started with VIP Kit and why I choose to stay with VIP Kit. So today I am pouring my heart out to you. So stick around and by the end you will understand why you are a starfish. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. So when people ask me why I started with VIP Kid, I totally understand why they're asking, right? Because VIP Kid is kind of a funky job. It's an awesome job, but it's kind of funky because we are teaching kids across the globe English online. It's a really cool job. So people often ask me, why do you do that? What made you want to do that job? And the tidy, nice packaged answer that I usually give them is that I've always loved languages and I've always loved kids and VIP Kid is the perfect way to marry the two. Oh, how nice, right? But that's not the whole story. That's true, I do love languages. I've lived in Spain a couple of times. I love languages. I've worked with ESL students before. And I love kids. I've worked with kids as long as I can remember in some capacity. I love them, okay? So I do love languages and I do love kids. But I also love the idea of being a stay-at-home mom. And if you've ever watched my videos before, you may be confused by that statement because you probably have never seen my kids before. And that's because I've never seen them either. I am not yet a mom, but VIP Kid was my plan for motherhood. And I'm probably going to get choked up here. <laughs> this is the part that keeps getting me um, a little choked up. But VIP Kid was my plan for pregnancy and motherhood, okay? So let's back up about two years. So in the spring of 2017, my husband and I were moving back to Pennsylvania from North Carolina. We had been in North Carolina for a job that I had in corporate America, and we ended up moving back to Pennsylvania for my husband's work. And so I had a clean slate. In other words, I was unemployed <laughs> and I was looking for a job. And so I searched languages and teacher on Indeed and I found VIP Kid. And it truly felt like a godsend for me. Of course, I was skeptical and it, I did not immediately apply, but um, it felt like a godsend because I had the languages, I had the kids, and it was a work from home job. And that was especially important to me because I know some people can work um, in pregnancy and do really, really well, right? But I knew from my family history that that may not be an easy road for me. So when my mom was pregnant with me, way back when, um, she was essentially on bed rest the entire pregnancy. And she was stuck at home. My mom was a nurse um, and she was not able to work for about nine months. I was a little early, maybe eight, eight and a half months or something. But anyway, she was not able to work at all or even leave the house. So VIP Kid would have been real nice for her. And the fact that I had the opportunity to get on board with VIP Kid before getting pregnant meant that I could get my ducks in a row. So VIP Kid really seemed like the perfect match for me. So starting out, my why was I got those things that I love, languages and kids, but I also get to pursue motherhood and not have to worry about the job aspect because VIP Kid is so flexible, okay? So that was my why, but my why has shifted a lot, okay? So I, I, I think it's really easy for us to assume that other people's journeys have been really easy. And I think that when people reach out to me, they often think that my life is really easy and it's glamorous and all these things that are not true at all. <laughs> so my mom had her first open heart surgery when I was three. My dad had leukemia and was diagnosed when I was seven, given months to live. You know, thank God they're both still alive and doing fairly well, they've both continued to have struggles. But anyway, I say this to say that my life has not been easy. I almost died as a teenager. Life has not been easy for me, okay? And it's not easy for any of us, but we find our why along the way and it changes as needed. So my why when I started with VIP Kid was because I wanted to be a stay-at-home, work-at-home mom, okay? but as I have helped hundreds of people get hired, my why has shifted, and now it's more about helping other people to achieve their dreams. Just because I have not 
achieved my dream yet does not mean that I can't be a part of helping someone else achieve his dream or her dream. And I have been just so immensely blessed to be a part of other people's journeys. Um, I take that responsibility so seriously and it is such an honor to watch someone be able to stay at home with their aging parents or be able to retire and still teach or be able to become a stay-at-home mom or a stay-at-home dad. That is the biggest honor in the world for me. So in some way, shape or form, yes, I have achieved my dream and I will keep achieving my dream through each and every referral that I help and through each and every subscriber. So you have become my wife. Why. So I can't thank you enough. Um, just a real quick story. I was at VIP Kid, the, the Journey Conference in Chicago about a month ago. That's a regional conference for VIP Kid. And I was just overwhelmed. I, I was overwhelmed by the passion in the VIP Kid community and how, how, how much love there is for teaching and for their why, right? And there was this one woman in particular who stands out in my mind because she came up to me and she asked for a hug. And of course I hugged her, I'm a hugger. Um, and she started crying and she said, Tina, I was in a really dark place. She said, I have lost, I had lost all love for teaching. And then I came across your YouTube channel and it just sparked something in me that told me I could do this, I could love teaching again. And I got hired with VIP Kid and now I love it and now I'm able to do what I love to do. And just hearing stories like that, you guys are my why. You guys are my why. Yes, of course, I want motherhood more than anything I've ever wanted in my life, right? I want to be a mom. Obviously, I love children, um, but my why is also you guys. So I wanted to share a real quick story to end on with you guys. Um, and you've may maybe you've heard this before, but there was this, there's this old man, okay? So I'm gonna paint the picture for you. There's this old man and he's walking down the beach. And as he's walking, he sees thousands and thousands of starfish that have been swept up on the, on the shore, right? And they're going to die because they don't have the water, right? The, the waves aren't reaching them anymore. Okay, so thousands of starfish. And the man looks over and he sees this little girl and she is stooping down and picking up one starfish at a time and throwing it into the sea. One starfish at a time, throwing it into the sea. See what I did there? <laughs> okay, and as she's doing this, the man just laughs and he looks at her and he says, little girl, don't you see all these thousands of starfish? How can you possibly make a difference? And she smiles back, stoops down, picks up one more starfish and says, I made a difference for that one. So you all are my starfish. Thank you so much for allowing me to be a part of your VIP Kid journey. And I will continue to do everything I can to help you. I have found my voice again, okay? I'm not going anywhere. And I would love to help you any way that I can on your VIP Kid journey. So if you found any part of this video to be helpful or inspiring and you think someone else would like it, please share it. Um, give me a like so I know that it was helpful. And I would love to hear in the comments below why you are a VIP Kid teacher or why you do something that you are passionate about. Thank you so much and I look forward to serving you along your VIP Kid journey. Bye Starfish.